say a few words about uh, the success uh, and what the Key Club has done this year. All right, right now I'm going to bring up our Key Club president, Brandy Schoenstall, right now. Advisor for our 
Marcel. I'd like to get a little bit of a gift from us. And it's a pleasure to do this because if this, the, the Key Club um, at Marshfield is very accomplished. And one of the reasons why we came up with this award this year was um, we were reflecting at one of our meetings and we were, we were looking at the past achievement. Um, and it's the kids that are filled with roles as advisors, as uh, leaders, and, and officers change every year, year after year, freshmen to sophomore to seniors. And the continuity and a lot of that success, the single point of continuity, is Joan. That is why we came up with this lifetime achievement. And we want to recognize you for that. And we, we love your participation in the club. And um, thank you very much for all you do for us. <laughs> and kids, we know we're out here. The free labor for the Kiwanis.
Thank you, John. I think um, well, the, the background on the red jacket is uh, a great intro for my next uh, agenda item. And I would like to ask uh, Dick Setson to come up and help me a little bit for our next item. Now I'll change the agenda a little bit, but perfect intro. So we'll go a little farther with what the comments that were just made. Uh, you can correct me, but I think it was 1978 when the Kiwanis Clubs of New England took on a new challenge. Uh, the challenge to build a new trauma center in our area. But it wasn't just any trauma center. Uh, Kiwanis went into this project knowing that more children died of accidental trauma than all the childhood diseases combined. So, along with the Boston Public Hospital, Kiwanis decided to help put together and to fund the first pediatric trauma center, not only in New England, but in this whole country. And they've been a model for every trauma center, I think, in the country since this one was built. Uh, as was said, uh, not only help put this together, but Kiwanis members, the Kiwanis Public, the women help fund the trauma center. And one way they do that is with this red jacket. And like I said, you can send a thousand dollar donation to the to the foundation, and you can get one of these. That's the first way. The second way is if a Kiwanis, a Kiwanis club can choose to purchase one of these to honor one of their own members. And my delight tonight to say that, that that's what this club is doing tonight. Uh, this member has been a member of Marshall Kiwanis. This is his 25th year. Uh, he's been a past president of Marshall Kiwanis not only once, but twice which gives him not only the distinction of past president, but the nickname that we've given him, Double D. <laughs> he's been president. He's been, he has watched over our finances and our investments as treasurer for as long as I can remember. Uh, he's been at all of our functions, almost every one of our meetings, as somebody who collects the money Somebody who's the auctioneer, wherever we've needed him, he's always been there. So it's a very proud to me to uh, announce that uh, Marshall Club has uh, got a red jacket from my good friend, the past president, Double D, Dick Bosley.
And we're honoring you, Jack, with a red jacket tonight. That also is on order, come back order. <laughs> so, consistent with tough policy. And Beth and I had an argument over your size of the jacket. I was going back and forth, she said you were 42. That's the way she sees you. <laughs> and I said, are you sure? And I had her double check your closets, you know, get you a 42. <laughs> I'm now 58. <laughs> Thank you. Um, next on the uh, agenda is uh, I want to recognize the veterans over here, Bill Dodge. The veteran. <laughs> you mind just introducing all the folks you brought here?
Jimmy calls him the Silver Fox. And the fight Silver Fox. And we all agree. So I'm going to turn over to the DJ for the last two items. One is the 50 50 raffle, and uh, the other is um, the centerpiece game. To win the centerpiece. Thank you. Thank you, Steve.